Today I'm going to show you how to bind a FreeSky X4R SB receiver to the Tyrannus radio. Okay? In order to do that, you're going to need a 5 volt power source. So this is what I'm using for my 5 volt power source. I've got a 3 cell LiPo battery. This steps it down to 5 volts. Okay? Right here on this connector. I'm going to set that aside for right now. Turn on the radio. Mm, you turn me on. Landing mode on. Okay, and I'm going to assume that you haven't created a model here, so I'll press menu, go down to slot number two, which is open, press enter, hold it down, press again to create the model, and let's presume we're going to set this up for a quad, so I'll go ahead and scroll over oops, to this quad symbol right here, press enter, I'm going to press page to go through all the default settings, press enter, hold it down, and now I've got the model created here. Okay, now I'm going to hit page and then press the minus key to scroll down and I'm going to go to the bind setting, but before I do that I am actually going to select the number of channels that S bus allows, so I'm going to have an S bus connection with this receiver. That's kind of the whole point of having this receiver in the first place. I'm going to bump it up to the 16 channel range, hit enter, press minus, press minus. Now I'm in the bind section, press the enter key. Okay, it's beeping, it's telling me it's ready to be in bind mode. All right. And I take the receiver, and there's a little button right here that I'm going to hold and press down. And I'm going to hook up the 5 volt power to the back row of pins here. It's pin number 2 is positive, and pin number 3 is negative. There's a little diagram right here that shows you where those connections are. Alright, so while I'm holding the button down, I'm going to go ahead and power up the receiver. Okay, now you'll see a red light flash and a green light is solid. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and press enter on the transmitter. And now we're bound. Okay, now I'm going to go ahead and take power off the receiver. Turn off the radio. Now I'm going to hook up power again to the receiver. Okay, and you're going to see a red blinking light. That means it's waiting for a signal from the radio. So I'll go ahead and turn on the radio. You turn me on. Now you've got a green light. You've successfully bound your receiver to your transmitter.